This is going to be a quick video going over the Martingale calculator. It's also position sizing calculator. I just call it Martingale. Most people are familiar with that term. You know, position sizing calculator, cost averaging calculator designed to automatically just show you the different lot sizes that come afterwards. Uh, most people who are familiar with Martingale know that uh, Martingale is basically like an account doubler. So you double the account or you double the lot size with every new trade or at whatever increment that you choose. So in other words, your first trade is 0.4, then the next one is double to 0.8, the next one is uh, 1.6, the next one after that is 3.2, etc, etc. But you don't have to use doubling if you don't want to. There's many different strategies that you can use besides doubling and as you can see I just show you the different multipliers that you could use as long as your multiplier is greater than one you can actually use one if you want to but typically to get the most amount out of cost averaging you want to increase your lot size as you go deeper into your position mainly because you're anticipating a pullback anyway so for those of us who are trading uh, especially more aggressive strategies you want to try and get as much out of the market as possible but you may not want to just straight up double you may want to only trade one and a half and it shows you the different possibilities there you may only want to trade 1.2 so at the same time you're still taking advantage of aggression but you can customize your level of aggression so it's pretty straightforward all you do to use this calculator just type in your initial lot size here so point five if I want to um, let's say I want to only use a point for micro lot brokers point zero three and then it will automatically calculate all the other lots that you will use you know it's so it's a really uh, helpful tool and this is used how you would use it in the spreadsheet well this is the different spreadsheet let me use the one how you would use it is in each price zone you may want to increment the amount of lot sizes that you would use so what you do is you take your initial lot size and you would put it in the first price zone that you want and then you would take the next lot size here and then you put it in the in the next price zone that you want and you take the next lot size and so as you're as you're going deeper into the trend or deeper into your trade from uh, as you move away from your initial trade the initial lot you're incrementally increasing the lot size and the idea behind that is that when the market pulls back because I trade a reverse strategy so in other words when the market is going up I sell and when the market is going down I buy but you know you could also trade it in the same direction you can pyramid in the same direction also but I'm just giving you an idea of how this uh, calculator works now the second half of this calculator the lot size this is just a, a very it, it works very similar to e5 f5 g5 up here in that it's just a quick calculator to show you your total amount of lots that you have open is you know say like five then this is the amount of margin that is required to hold all five of those lot sizes at 400 to one leverage and an exchange rate for the pair that you're trading and uh, this is how much leverage would be required for 300 lot for 93 lot and you could type in whatever number you want here don't worry about this pit value column it's not really too important but um, so I just wanted to go ahead and explain the Martingale calculator or cost averaging position sizing calculator so that's it and uh, in the next video we're gonna go ahead and show you how this all comes together in an actual automated strategy that you could use unattended